Greetings, citizens of this watery world. I'm Catherine of Sky, and we're back in Timberborn to take care of our little beavers. Now, I have something special for you today um, because we have a message from one of our primo beavers, Sabarus Terrace, who I believe has been on this journey through all of our car uh, colonies. He, uh, I think they are one savvy beaver keeping on going and visiting all of our uh, places as we move through time. Must be a millennium beaver. Um, anyway, our message today is coffee, the favorite drink of the civilized world, quote by Thomas Jefferson. With larger water wheels and some good levees, industry is going to start taking off. Soon we might need more than simple latte huts to mull over bigger plans. I do dearly hope they'll leave my shop open for old time's sake. Sometimes the best thoughts come with a quiet room and a warm cuppa after all. Number crunching isn't... Uh, all there is to invention, at least I hope not. Calculators don't leave tips. The barista. So, yeah. <laughs> Very apropos for our current project here. Um, and I'm pretty excited uh, to see how our beavers cope with this new uh, machinery and stuff. So this, this requires a lot of gears. Many 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 years so um i think we'll have to wait till the wet season happens um because we're out of stuff right now do we have any unemployed beavers no otherwise i'd start the plank industry up again but i think we're we can we can wait out a couple of days and just leave it as it is so in the last episode we decided to start a brand new colony over here and I think it's going to be pretty cool, pretty successful. Um, we haven't, this is going to be a farming colony. And what we need in this farming colony is to build tiny little wet spots uh, with the, um, what do you call those things? The water dumps, which we don't, I don't think we have them researched yet. So we're going to need those. That's important. Uh, this is exciting to get our number cruncher up here as well. I'm curious. Oh yeah, that's right. It runs into this and that connects to that. So the power connects between them. Life is better. Better, better. But we need power. God, we need power. Help. Um, yeah. What do we do about power? Do we like build a large structure, like a very tall thing here? Or maybe we build on the edge of a cliff here? Maybe we build those batteries there so they can drop down as far as possible. That is, that's might be what we need actually is to build this up kind of over here. Um, how big are batteries? I think they're one by like three or something, but we don't have enough science points anyway. We need more latte, more coffee for beavers. All right. We have 0.1 days left, which is great. We can get power very soon. I don't think we paused anything specifically here. Um, it looks like we have so much oil, 323. I'm actually going to pause the oil making because we don't really need it. I'd rather have the beavers working in other places than kind of wasting time on that. Okay. Yep, I know. I'm sorry. Building needs water. Yeah, I know. Everything collapses during the drought season. It's kind of terrible. It's not ideal. These mangroves are really growing well over here. Soon. Flooding soon will happen. Where is the water? I guess the good thing about the water... Um, being far away is, yeah, we don't get the immediate effects of the rainy season starting, but we do, uh, have longer where it stays, which it kind of balances out. Basically, it's not really that important even to mention. Okay. We have six pieces of dynamite. Uh, that's fantastic. We do, we have the ability to use it though. No, we need 600, uh, po points, but yeah, we are way, way over our, um, 
our quota there on stuff. So I'm gonna, I'm going to do a thing here. I wanna, uh, I wanna, let's build a staircase here and there and there. Okay, and these are gonna be, we're gonna get stuff going from here. I think I'm just gonna delete these trees and stuff. And then we can delete this. Don't know what that's for. All right, good. So my idea is to get the number cruncher up and running. I'm hoping we can do that. Do we have enough gears? We have 79. That's quite a lot. That's not bad. It's actually not bad. All right, this whole island is flooded. I should. I would like to just put dynamite here to clear that channel for the water coming in. All right, keep on going, guys. Keep on building, my little beaver friends. Let's see, we can probably prioritize a lot of this, actually, because I don't think we've done it. No, we haven't. Okay, we need all that stuff done, please. And this has got to get done as well. Is there anything on lower floors here that is not quite finished or needs priority? No, it seems to have gotten the whole thing, which is great. Yeah, it fit together well. I probably should have reused this area, though. Hmm. It's fine, though. It's just fine. We'll get it going there. The beavers are working. You can see them putting stuff in place and getting all these little bits and pieces that we need. This doesn't need to be high priority. That's actually can be medium because it's <laughs> that corner is not necessary. I don't know how necessary any of these corners are, but hopefully they can get the number cruncher finished soon. They don't have any materials in it. I guess they haven't finished the base yet. But this is also quite important. Um, the fermenter, let's see. I think we'll do fermented mushrooms, but we need to just put this on down priority because we don't actually have fermented mushrooms at the moment. All right, do we have research happening? Yes, all three latte huts are busy. That's fantastic. I think we wanna turn these down though. We wanna turn them way down. Actually, our middle one was the one that was operating at high efficiency. We need to kind of put the, sh the employees elsewhere right now. This isn't flowing at all, and that's not, not making me happy. I think the angle is too bad over here, and, you know, there's not much you can do about it other than dig better, you know? But we need to dig this out before we can build the next water wheel and see how it actually is functioning. All right, we have gotten quite a lot of stuff delivered here. Um, we're almost uh, totally finished with the gears, which is great. We have 13 metal blocks, so that's half of them, or slightly more than half. This is pretty good. We're, all the planks have been set. That's fantastic. It's always where we're running short. All right, very cool kind of thinking maybe I should build one of these layers for planks you know like why not have a whole bunch of planks in here they store 180 so if I build let's build one build it on this side this can become a battery storage later planks yo okay I am your girl for planks let's go with this okay and here and that's perfect. Okay. And then we do staircase here. Okay. And that can be, let's do that medium high so that we can keep getting these planks made. But first priority is number cruncher. We need this done. All we need is metal planks though, or metal blocks. And we do have this metal area, which is still not done yet. Uh, let's see. They have 20 of 20 scrap metal. I'm thinking they probably don't have enough haulers. I'm gonna open this up a bit, and get more. Okay, hello. 
Are we ready? Getting those metal blocks made. I mean, we're trying. We are trying here. Let's see. This is making explosives. That's great because we're going to need a bunch. Oh my god, we have 28. <laughs> That's grown quickly. Well then. Okay. Um... You know, we have also the ability to make the healer. Oh, that's right. We were working on this area. I forgot about that. Okay, healer just needs metal blocks and things and stuff. We can put them right here. Um, or like this, potentially. Yeah, maybe like that is fine. We'll have a healer. It's, it's worth it to have healthy beavers for sure. All right, and this rest of this stuff needs to go. I don't know why I didn't, like, delete this before. But that's got to go. All right, and we can put in an extra bed or maybe... You know what? Let's let's be cozy. Let's build a shrine here so that the beavers can pray for the sick beavers. I like that idea. That's very nice. Cool. Also, they, these tents and stuff, they can be covered over with... Um, or can they... Can they not anymore? They used to be able, you could cover them with with um, these platforms. You could have like multi-level hospitals. Looks like that's not a thing. Oh, that's so sad. Aw. I kind of enjoyed having these like huge hospitals. Darn it. That's why I kind of built it on this terrace area. I guess it still works out, but um, that used to be a thing uh, before update four. So I'm guessing the devs didn't really like that you could do that. And so they kind of removed it. But it's okay. I mean, we'll live with it. It's just fine. Okay, this place is the healer. Makes medicine and uh, distributes it. What we can do up here is maybe we make the medicine uh, thingy up here. We can have a huge uh, vat for the medicine up here. So let me reprioritize these guys into emergency mode. Because I want them gone. Go, go, go. And then we do like a medium tank. 300 can be stored in this tank. Please? Is there another one there? Oh my god. It bred. Uh, okay, I gotta do this. Priority up, please. Okay, it's nighttime. They're not gonna do anything about it. <gasps> Number cruncher is going! Look at this. Woo! Okay. Now, and it goes all night long. You don't need no beavers. It is a calculating machine. Oh, that's fantastic. And it's going to use our power, that's for sure. But it's kind of cool because it uses power during the nighttime. You can actually pause it if you wanted to. Wait, are we out of food? No, people are just haven't eaten yet. Okay, it's fine. Um, all right, so this is going to be... Oh, wait, we didn't get the other one. So storage for liquids is going to be here and we're going to make a, uh, no water, no medicine. Yes. There we go. Okay. So let's put these on medium priority up, not the shrine, but these two. Okay. Now I want to figure out how to make coffee. Where is that? Okay. It's here. Coffee brewery. Just costs a bit of gear and stuff, but they get coffee. I kind of want the hydroponic garden though, too. I want everything. <laughs> oh my goodness. Do we have enough to make another? Uh, no, we have three gears. That's it. We don't have more gears. We need more gears. Uh, what I can do though, is we can connect more things here. So... We're already demanding more because of the number cruncher. It takes a lot of power, that's for sure. So, um, let's see. We're going to pause this place because we don't have any mushrooms at all. Um, what were we going to do next? I kind of, like, forgot. I have many interests. Like, I really want to get into... Oh, we might need a mine as well. Do we... We saw a mine where? Where was it? Here's one over there. That's really far away, though. There's one there. It's, again, really far away. Um, oh, dynamite. That's what we wanted to do. There's one over here. That might be the closest, because this would be the closest village to that mine. Okay. Let's get um, dynamite unlocked. That is the first thing. Yes. Okay, so... Let's do some dynamiting. So, 
okay the the distance from the uh place is like 15 tiles so if we count let's see maybe here one two three four five six seven nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifty okay this is quite far actually maybe i'll put it right there maybe you know this one might do the entire area really okay let's put this on high and get our road going like here just put it oh thank you autosave okay that was weird but yeah let's let's try the dynamite right there uh, and this means we can also put dynamite um, in these areas I think let's see I think the best thing what is the best thing so I don't even remember what parts get oh this part okay that's right we were gonna unplant these trees here and let's cut one right at the end actually do we need it no we just ha are unplanting these and that's fine um, let's get the dynamite right there. I don't think we even need to cut it because it's already sticks. It's like dried sticks. I really like that about the game. It's like, it really acknowledges like how, um, like how fragile stuff is and like, okay, if it's dried out, it's just going to be sticks. You can just whack it with your, with your foot or something and it will go away. I like that. It feels quite, uh, natural. Like you don't have to remove everything in this big process it's pretty cool i really love like the nature values that the devs have given the game it's so nice okay so the next one we could actually just put one here by the road or maybe like by this berry bush or no maybe right there and that'll reach for sure so let's just delete these two things We'll put those on high priority. Oh, nice. We're getting planks up here. Boom. Hooray. Okay, so we have 165 now. That's fantastic. Okay, so if we get this, and then we go and put in our dynamite over here. Oh, that's not going to work, is it? Crap. Um, No, we need a water dump. Let's see. This is going to do this. 250 science points. Did we get one here? No, no. Oh, we haven't exploded it yet. Go. Boom. Go. Boom. Yeah. Okay. So we need to get that built. We need to get these trees gone immediately. Arg. Okay. Well, excuse me. Auto save. Be careful. Okay. So where were we going to do the thing over here? Did I forget already? Mm, I think we didn't decide, right? What we could do is move this water baby uh, over there. Uh, let's see. We can just delete this one. Our, the baby will be transferred. He's right now in another vat with another one. He's in the bottom, so you can't see him. He's like swimming around, just FYI. No beavers were harmed in the making of this thing. All right. Uh, let's get this thing gone. And that. Okay. Good. This one is done. Hooray. All right. Water dump is going to be activated. Hooray. Okay. Did they fix this? Yes. Okay. Now here we get our dynamite up. All right. And where else did we have one? We had one over here. We were calculating this. So we actually need the water dumps are funny because they, yeah, that won't work. We would need these two bushes, I think, or these two is fine too. I think we take those. 
Um, and then replant that one. I miscalculated. I thought we could have it kind of facing that way. And uh, no. <laughs> no. That don't work. Is that far enough from the water? Probably. I think it's far enough. Okay. Coffee bush right there. Okay. Good. And of course we need to put in these uh, priority thingies. This is high priority as well. Get, wa uh, get footpaths here. Oh, oh, I hear the thingy. Okay, so here, come on guys. Put the explosives in, it's gonna be fine. Also, if we have enough, okay, we need to get this going. So, landscaping, let's -a go. Here. And then this also needs to be done. Okay, can they go that way? I think they can. Can they? Did we decide that they could go through here? Wait, no, this is a... Oh, that's the medium warehouse. Yeah, we have that slight problem, don't we? Just a slight problem. So wait, how, they can't even get through this way. How do they get here? Uh, is this... Medium warehouse. They can get here somehow. Probably through this way, I'm guessing. But the number cruncher doesn't need to have citizens yet, and that one is not functional. So what I'm going to do is let's remove the road here. And we're just going to have the stream go straight through. Um, okay, dynamite. I could actually put another water wheel in here as well. Maybe I will. That would probably require me to have some more bridgey bridges built here. Um, let's build them. So let's see if we build the water wheel here, it's going to have to be supported there with the thingy up there. So I guess the best thing is to go underneath here like that until we absolutely need to take a step up barrier. Demolish this please. All right. Oh my god, the cat is destroying the house again. Oh dear, she's caused a cascade. <laughs> I can hear it. No! Oh, the cat. Oh, they're working on the dynamite here. Okay, detonate. Cool. So now, that means we can build another water wheel here. I love this game so much. All the water wheels and stuff. It's so much fun. It's like, wow, this is great. This is great. It be great stuff. Okay. So, um, all right, I'm going to high prioritize this stuff over here or medium priority. I guess it's not like super high. Uh, all right. How's this going? All right. This is great. Detonate. And let's put in our water dump over there. This is also high priority. Thank you. And this should be medium high, I think. All right. Wow. Look at this. It's all fixed. It's green. Oh my God. It's green. Hooray. Okay. So, all right. So we cleared this area as well. Remember we were going to try to do maybe a tapper's shack uh, or some kind of like tree clearing situation over here. Uh, all right. So what I want to do is I want to keep on deleting some of these like bushes that we don't need. Um, the trees. Hmm. I'm kind of tempted to just delete the trees because they're not great. Actually, you know what? They're, they're okay-ish. There's, I just like, oh my God, there's so many over there. <laughs> I was like, okay. Um, I think what I'm going to do is issue a cutting order. Okay, we have one. A very extensive one. Um, and I'm going to just put a lumberjack right in the middle of this. I'm going to put you right there and we'll get that going. And hopefully we'll get all those trees cut. 
Now you apparently are done cutting trees. You have nothing left to do. So delete, enter, go. Now then, um, we have the homes, the, the housing. We don't have any showers or any kind of like amenities yet in this uh, area. So I think I would like to, I would like to build them like a shower here and they can have a grindstone over there. It's kind of like little tiny amenities that they can get going on here. Oh my goodness, there's the culprit. I hear the culprit. What else can we do? Med they need medical beds. Hmm, that's gonna be a problem possibly. They also should need some, they also sh will have some breeding going on here. One of the things that we can do is actually we can harvest this blueberry area right there. We need to, to come up with some kind of like clever way of um, growing stuff over here, I think. Let's see. We need to get rid of, let's get rid of the dandelions because we don't need them right now. Might need them later because I'm thinking we could even have like this whole thing could be like this huge healing situation here and um, they can bring the medicine over here. That's what, what I'm thinking. Okay, so this is a huge farming area. I think what I would like to do is build, um, what are what large, where, I forgot, is that this one? Oh no, I've not seen that one yet. Hello, okay, that's huge. How much does it hold? 1,200. I'm thinking that could be a good number, you know, for like whatever we're gonna cook over here. But I also wanna figure out, so uh, we had the other food situation of the hydroponic gardens. Um, and I'm really curious about this. So let's see, so they're solid. They can be built in stacks, it looks like. So they need water and they make stuff. Algae and mushrooms, okay. So what does this look like? If I put it next to the water, that would be beneficial. And, oh, it could potentially share a staircase with the other building here. So let's go up. Oh, that is up. Okay, okay, there is the second level up here. So I could take this and we could have already the, hmm, what I'm thinking, I should put it a bit closer, shouldn't I? I'm worried about this staircase. Do we care about that staircase? Probably not, actually. We could just put it right next to it and delete that staircase altogether because we have one right there. So I think it, it would be okay. Oh. Okay, thank you, autosave. That was a bit nuts. Thank you. Because it's too good of a, of a situation to pass this up, like having stacking buildings that both need the same kind of staircase structure. So I think it's a good idea. All right, so this place is going to take care of the stuff and the things. Okay, cool. That might be an issue for this side, potentially. All right, in any case, let's delete the staircase. It is now gone, 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 gone. And roads, okay. All right, so now the next thing is to, oh, we have to delete one bush or two bushes actually. That I didn't think about, but that needs to be done on priority, please. Oh, but this doesn't work, does it? No, it doesn't work. It doesn't work as a sharing structure because, well, it might actually. Hold on, hold on. Let's cancel that. Those perfectly nice berry bushes. Okay, so what we can do to share, which is what we intended to do, is, um, put the entrances the other way. Why not? All right, and wood. Do we want to have... Hmm. 
This, this doesn't have to store wood. It can also store those funky planks that we're probably going to make because we're going to have a pine forest up here. So I think that would be okay. Now, we do need to probably remove this bush. So let's remove these bushes. On priority, please. Okay. And then we can build our staircase, which needs to be like this up. And then, oh, another bush. I wish you could do, you know, delete on those. That would be a nice, <laughs> pardon me, a nice thing. So we have the double platform here, which will have entrances like this. Oh, whoops, that's the wrong height, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay. That was not what I needed to do. Come on. Go away. Are you... You're not high priority yet. Come on. Behave thing. So this is going to go here like this. And then... Um, we can do a, another stair here and then go like this. Let's put in the roads first so I don't forget them. There we go. Okay. And then another one there, which is just going to be kind of circling around to there. And I think that will work quite nicely. Okay. That has been removed. So that's nice. Okay. And we have this very beautiful kind of structure here where we can build stuff. Now I want to remove this stuff here because I feel like this is, could be a good spot for a forester out here. Now, do we have the ability to get through? Yeah, we do have, we can go underneath there, which is fine. Um, we can also use the stairs to go up to the second level which is also very good. Um, we can't, we don't have access to the third level yet, but what I want to do, I think I'm going to cut everything here. I just want to cut all the trees on the different levels and see what the heck we have with this mountain. It is like, I don't know. It's hard to see because of all of the trees and stuff over here. So I kind of want to cut all the, all the trees we've got. Um, and then, yeah. And figure it out, basically. Chop it all down. It's fine. It'll be fine. Let me get a lumberjack to assist in this work. Put it right there. Um, go ahead and assign these to be higher priority, as well as all of these dandelions here. Uh, these, actually, I would like them to be on medium priority. That would be nice. Let's assign them. So the first one we're going to have, you're going to make mushrooms. Let's just do mushrooms, algae, mushrooms, and then algae. Okay. So this one, let's get the road going there. Okay. So that's nice. And I think we'll have the cooking plants out here. Um, and those are going to involve, so that's a food factory where we need corn, uh, eggplants and algae, those are made into various things. So what does that look like? That's quite big. Okay. It's like this. So we're going to need at least three of these, which should be fine. Um, I'm going to go ahead and also and delete everything on this island pronto. Not sure why I didn't do that before. Seems like a, a very nice thing to do. <laughs> okay, let's get these things going there. And I think I want to make... Okay, these could all be warehouses underneath, I guess. Uh, all right, let's do that. Small warehouse. One, two, three. Just to give a little bit of extra... Um, extra building space. And this is going to have to be extended. Let's see. This is going to go like that.
that probably and we'll probably delete this thing but let's get the island cleared first oh god i didn't even notice we had a drought that's so funny now this area this is going to be interesting because we have to figure out how to put farming here um, so those giant warehouses, do we really want them right here? We could put them just like here, just kind of generically. Um, cause if we put farms on top, it's going to be like two staircases down or is it three? No, it's two. Okay. But it does seem like a huge, huge thing. Um, what I'm thinking is we do soybeans and well, soybeans, kohlrabi and cassava here so we would need three of them um let's see yep i think we can do that I'm kind of like thinking in my head what i want to do here um yeah if we do three that's a lot of land oh my god it's horrible is that too much? It might be too much to give away. Um, okay. So the idea here was to get like three farmhouses approximately. Um, let's see, we can do one, two, and three. We can do one facing that way. And I did put a, or I was supposed to put a gap between them. Okay. Farmhouse. Yo, here. Uh, we could even put extra storage out here. Now, the idea with these farmhouses is that we could have, like, a path uh, coming up and coming down here from either side, like this, so that they can reach the fields more easily. And then we can connect this with a, a road this way. Okay, there we go. And that is going to be our farming area. We could even put another farmhouse on here. Is that too much area to give away for farmland? I don't know. We could even like extend the farms up here. I mean, we don't have to have them, um, you know, in, in specific places, I guess. Okay. Let me, it looks like the, oh God. Okay. I don't like when stuff just is like piecemeal. It's very annoying. Um, I want to get in the forester. We'll put them here. Seems like a very nice place to put them. Oh, if we could only delete this tree. Oh my God. All right. Cutting. Can I cut that? Dude, cut that tree, please. Okay. It should be one of the first trees they cut actually. So that's, that should be fine. Um, does look like there is very little in the way of I guess they'll tell us though if we have no trees there are a few trees growing so that is also a thing now up here we do have a water source but it's not flooded right now so this stuff is dying a little bit I think I want to extend the berry patch a little bit because I think we're gonna need them in terms of having, you know, these baby, baby beavers happening. Um, let's see, get those. I think those should grow. Now then, uh, crops. Let's get some kohlrabi. Something like that. Maybe a little bit more. I'm trying to divide this in thirds, and that's kind of difficult when it's like a halvesy kind of thing. Okay, demolish that one. Okay, that should be fine. All right, and then we'll have um, cassava. I think the other area in the home place is more than enough for what we need. Oh my god, all of these dandelions and stuff are really messing with, with me. Um, the same with these bushes. I don't want them here. We can have crops here instead. Uh, we'll put these on high priority to get rid of. Okay. So cassava. Wait, what were, were we doing cassava? Wait, hold on. Ah, brain. Yeah, cassava. Okay. Let's take that up to like here, maybe. 
And then the rest can be soybeans, I think. This is a great farming area. Oh my God, it's so good. Um, I think we're going to leave space here for a road, maybe. If I can get it sorted. There we go. All right. Then we'll have a road to go up there. Free staircase, yay. And we can put another water dump up there. So these are our grand plans right now. That's pretty great. And these farmhouses, okay, they can reach everywhere in this whole area. So that's perfect. Um, all right, so this was what, cassava? Hello? Plant crops, cassava. Does kind of make me think like, maybe we need more um, kohlrabi? A little bit. Okay, so let's do, let's assign these things here. Cassava, sure. Next one. Corn, eggplants, mushrooms, soybeans. Uh, okay, where's the kohlrabi? Oh, it's probably in the fresh food here, or the edible food, I should say. Kohlrabi. Okay, cool. Very nice. Okay, and one last thing. Some more kohlrabi here. There we go. Okay, pretty nice. Pretty darn nice. So this beaver um, finished all the areas in their thing, which tells us that we need to uh, move toward other heights. To that end, let's see if we can get this going here. This is quite interesting, like building this maze-like kind of area. Okay, good. Um, number cruncher is going well. This one is also going well. We need a bunch of gears again for this. I think I should make another gear maker. I only have one. That's not great. Let's see, over here... I could make another gear maker right here. That is possible. But we don't have power there yet. So that is slightly unideal. Let's make another gear maker here. So the power, let's see. So first of all, we need to get this. Wait, why is this not done, done yet? Um, oh yeah, we forgot about this part. Yep, detonate. Bye. Um, that means, ooh, that means we get more water. Oh, the other wheel has been finished. That's perfect. So power, more wheels. Let's go. No, not that one. Oh, dude. Okay. Ah, we need more dynamite here. Actually, I forgot about that. We need to do that before we set up these things. So one, two, three, four, five. That is the length of the wheel. And then, um, right, we were trying to, uh, can I just put something over this like that? No. Oh, dude, please. Why? Why you gotta be so hard, man? All right. I guess we cancel this because I can't get under there until we like, unless we blast a hole, which is not really what I want to do. So let's put this on high priority. All right, and these also. So we should be able to reach them from both sides of this water thing. This is kind of gonna be a deprecated path, I think. What we can do is, well, what we need to do is we need to connect this to the other power systems. So if it has the thingy here, which I think it will, Oh, there they go. They're filling in the blanks. Nice. 
Number crunching is going on. That's so nice, man, to have the number cruncher. It's super good. All right, come on. Okay, also we can open these guys up to farmers so they can start doing things. Okay, how's this going? We need that last one done. Oh, beautiful. So let's go detonate. Boom. And that means we get uh, another wheel to put in here. Large water wheel. There we go. Boom. So um, now we can do the high power shaft, which brings this. Okay, just wanted to make sure it's on the right level, which brings us over there, I think. So if we take this here, we'll be on the same uh, area as that. Let's put in our little connectory thingies. Oops, I forgot that one there. Boom, nice. So this wheel will be connected to that. Um, we can't connect on the same... I'm trying to think if we can use this space for anything. Like, maybe put another lumber mill out here or something, but I don't think so. Might be able to use this space, though. This is... Okay, we have the idea of a path here. Okay, we could move some of these crops just a tiny bit. So let's see, if we had this, actually we need to build it in twos, I believe. All right, there we go. So if we had this, we could put another gear maker there um, and then just find the entrance for this. So what do we need here? Do we need gears or do we need, we might just need planks actually. Let's see, how many planks do we have? We have 93. Okay, so definitely need another gear maker. We can chuck this here. And the entrance, I'm going to make it a little bit more clever. I think that's a better idea than destroying the crops. Let's just do this. Perfect. Very nice. And then these can be... Um, we don't actually need this path here. Okay, very cool. So this is going to get, hopefully, some some attention soon. How are we doing on logs? Oh, we have millions. Fantastic. Oh, this is so great. Okay, now we need to get a road here. So that is actually connected and we'll have greenness. Greenness is good. Wow, we still didn't put the dynamite here. Shoot. Okay, it's fine. We have one road and that's so they can get entry to all of these crops over here let's put that on high excuse me Ugh. also we are really low on water i think i think we need another pump person here so let's hire somebody feels like we're low so i'm like wait we haven't done water in like forever <laughs> we need to do the water Okay, we have 1.9k science points. I'm thinking we can build another, like a gigantic water tank. 1,200 water. How big is that? That's big. Okay. So what I'm thinking is we remove these crops here and put in the water tank. It is a... It fits there. Yeah, it's, it'll fit there. Okay. So let's get... Get removing these things. There we go. Put that on high. Got so much stuff going on here. Let's see, down a little bit here. I want to figure out why these plants are not getting deleted. Oh, it's because we don't have enough um, pathway here. Yeah that on high too far from the district cannot be reached okay there's something going on with the pathing then ah it's the medium warehouse thing okay so all right we need to go up and figure out how they can get down yeah we were gonna <laughs> we'd have to destroy the metal thingy over there no i don't want to destroy that 
Uh, hmm. New problems, right? Am I right? New problems. What is down underneath this one? Okay, so this is the mechanism. That is a bad thing to try to remove. But they could go around this way. Um, this is non-removable either. I mean, I guess I could do just a downward stair here. That would be okay. But we do need to find a way to connect it from the other side, I feel. So hopefully they can get to that. Soon. Please, soon. There we go. Okay. Put that on high priority. All right, so, all right. If we remove this thing, what exactly is affected by this? So it would be this one. All right, that would be both metal smelters. I mean, I guess I can rebuild them as long as we have enough scrap metal. We have 16 scrap metal and we can find more Hmm. Hmm, I say. Uh, all right. We do need to connect them. We really do. Um, all right. <laughs> oh, I hate doing this. Uh, that was painful. Ow. Okay, we need to delete this. And then... This one. Delete. Delete. Why is it not letting me delete? Is there something on top? Oh yes, there's a path on top. I still can't delete it. Oh god. Okay. Gears on top. Okay, now we can delete it. God. This feels so bad. Okay, so the path goes there tiny bit squiggly. I think what I'll do is I'll just... Actually, we can leave it. It's fine if it's squiggly. So then we can replace this with a warehouse facing this way, which is just fine. Um, we can also add some here. What's above that? There's nothing there. Okay, cool. So this can be just like a little warehouse row. All oh, the underneath of the city, the dockyards and stuff. Ah, cool stuff. Very cool. Okay. I'll put that one facing there. Sure. So then, then what? We can put another one there, actually. I'm using like every single square. This is like the dockyards, all this stuff and things. Kind of cool. All right. Um, so now this part needs to be re mm, refilled with these guys. I think we'll need that and that. So this part, we needed a gear to connect. Right there. And then we get the buildings. I have actually forgotten how they were situated. So I'm kind of like, huh? <laughs> Which way again? I know they were like, this one was here. Okay. So that one can still be there. All right. And was this one like there or this way? Could be either way, actually. That one would leave more space. I thought it was like, I don't even remember how it was like, honestly. Okay, well, it's fine. We'll, we'll figure it out. It'll be fine. I'm going to put this one on high priority. We need to get everything underneath it, though, on a high priority as well. So I'll just do that right now. Um, all right, so metal, smelter. Okay, 
And that means we could actually have another something here. I don't know what, but something. Some kind of like building. And then here is another warehouse opportunity, of course. I kind of love, like, this is very, like, old London dockyards feel for me. It's like, oh, yeah, all these, like, hidden spaces and stuff. Pretty dang cool. All right. So that is our new plan with actual roads so that they can delete this stuff. Hooray. They did it. That's good. All right. But we're going to work more on this later. How far are they on this one? Oh, they're actually quite done. Almost done. We just need those silly metal blocks that come from these silly structures, which have been recently deleted. Who built this factory, man? Who built this colony? Anyway, um, I really appreciate you being here. Thank you so very much. Um, if you want to help uh, my channel grow, please, you know, check out the new animation on the like button and uh, make a comment if you feel like it. And as always, it's been a pleasure to play for you. So thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.